What's going on everybody, Weebo here, and welcome back to some more Rogue Tower. It's finally time for the encampment, or the mine tower, or whatever you want to call it. Uh, we're playing with a couple mods, just like always. Level to RPM mods, so it shoots faster every time we level it up, and additional enemies that drop additional gold. And I'll have all the mods linked down below. Let's get right into it. Alright, you guys know the drill. Put the ballistas down, get the extra gold in the beginning until we can unlock our card. Yeah, whatever. That's good enough. And... Really? I didn't get it first try. I'm surprised. There it is. We just need to find a good spot to put it now. I'm thinking maybe right there. Alright, alright. Level 6, that's fine. Sell all these guys and we'll put our encampment down. Come on. You think I'd be faster at this? Alright, hear me out. Here's okay, right? But here, I can get both sides. Right? Right? Yeah? What do you guys think? I, I'm thinking, I'm thinking right there. Probably not the best choice, but you guys can let me know down below. You always do. Wow, this thing's cheap. Uh, okay, 31 RPM. Lots of damage already. Let's see how it does. It does play some pretty... Is there a limit? I don't think there's a limit on how many I can place down. If there is, this is going to be a, a short video. Let's see. We'll expand again. I feel like we're going to get overwhelmed unless this thing can get its attack speed up. Like, pretty quick. Yeah, people are starting to come through already. It's okay, though. We're doing okay. Take Golden Forest and some into armor. We're into health. Let's see, what are we at? 35 RPMs now. I mean, it... It'll get more time as the rounds get longer to put stuff down, so that's always a plus. Oh. That's a little scary. Uh-oh. Oh, it lost a little bit of health, but that's okay. You know, we might actually have to use the mines. Let's see. Let's just put a couple down, just in case. And on to level 10. See, he's going to have more time to put stuff down now. And eventually he'll be really fast. I just don't know if he'll be able to keep up with the sheer volume of enemies that there are going to be. You know? Seems like he's doing better this round, though. Oh, nothing got through. That's good. 25% burn damage. I don't think we really need it, but we'll take it. It'd be nice for Oogie. In a couple waves. Well, we're healing our tower too, which is good. I'm hoping... Because it has to be one mine per... Is it one mine per enemy, or is it... Based on how they're grouped up? It must be how they're grouped up, because everything blew up right there. Ooh, extra range. That'll probably help out a lot. Yeah, let's get some to shield. Alright. What are we looking like? Uh, 61 now. I mean, that's... He's throwing them out. Can someone down below let me know if there's a limit to how many? I'm not thinking so, but... I don't know. I 
it seems there's like a limit on how many squares it'll actually go in. Like it's not really going in between things, which is fine. Wow, he looks like he's doing a lot better. There we go. That's faster. 67. Uh, let's do some extra burn damage. Why not? Alright, going on to wave 15. I think Oogie might be a problem. We'll find out though. We're looking like 79 RPM, level 57. Yeah, we're doing okay. It's not, not terrible. He's definitely spitting out a lot faster, which is good. But, I don't know. We haven't had anything get past since... What was that, like wave 9? Fingers crossed now, because there's a lot of enemies in this wave. And Oogie's gonna take a lot of landmines. Oh, not as many as I thought. That was 4? That's not bad. Well then. There's a ton over here. It doesn't seem that there's a limit to how many I can put down yet. But, we'll see later on. All right, end of wave 19 into level 20. We're looking pretty good. Nothing's made it past. We have a ton of range now. And let's see, let's get a couple of these upgraded. Looking like level 93, fire rate of 142, and everything's pretty close to 5,000 damage. So yeah, I think we're doing pretty good. Look at that thing go. The only problem we could have with this tower, if it just like down the road if it just can't keep up with the number of enemies that show up but I mean for now we've been doing really good it's not they haven't made it past this side in 10 waves or so because it doesn't matter how fast or slow they are or how tanky they are most of them get one shot so it's a uh, as you can see doesn't really go very well for them but like I said if there's enough enemies they could overwhelm the landmines I don't know this will be an interesting one to one to see because it could go either way I have a feeling we're gonna win though pretty confident that they're not gonna stand a chance Yeah, that's, that's my best guess. All right, level 25, tower is at a level 129, almost 9,000 damage on everything, and a fire rate of 220. Um, we got God King Oogie coming in, look at that, it's already like full. Just fills up so fast now. I, I was worried about that before, but I don't know. It fills up so fast, I, I don't think we're going to have a problem. I don't think there will be enough enemies to overwhelm it, because it just goes so fast now. And it doesn't blow up all the mines, it just blows up like one or two every time they hit, so... I think we're good. Just look at that thing go. Just keep spitting them out. It is funny how they kind of congregate on, like individual tiles. I'm sure that's how it's coded or something, but it just looks interesting. Let's see. Oh, Oogie only took a couple of hits. Wow. Yeah, um, like I said, I've got a feeling this tower is going to do pretty well. It's, uh, it does a lot of damage, and upgrades are decently cheap. I mean, we're level 129, and upgrades are still only $1,200. I think we got to on the obelisk, that's like the fifth level. <laughs> so this is this is gonna be pretty good. All right, level twenty nine. We're gonna see what we can max out now. We're going into level thirty. Seventy four on everything. Fourteen thousand damage. Two hundred and eighty three RPMs. That thing is crazy fast now. Um. 
Yeah, stuff just doesn't make it by anymore. It's a uh, it's pretty gross, I'm not gonna lie. We're I don't know. This this might be one of my favorite towers just because it like one shots everything. Not the most fun thing to look at, but hey, you know what? It's okay. It does pretty good. At least at least we're doing good with it. Nothing's made it by I don't think anything's made it past here, honestly, or even here. Definitely one of the top 5 towers. For sure. It's cheap. I mean, it's already up to level 173. It's cheap. It does a lot of damage. It's got decent range once you get the full upgrades. I, I would say top five tower so far. Not the best tower. That still is held by the vampire tower. I don't know if anything's going to ever beat the vampire tower. But definitely... Everything better than like the ballistas and a lot of other stuff, but just look at that. There's so many down in one spot now. That's crazy. What is it? I mean, it's just a tent with barbed wire around it. And it's throwing out all these landmines, huh? This poor guy, he doesn't know what's coming. Boom. Oh, we got a bunch of missiles coming in now. Level 32. This could pose to be a problem just because there are so many extra entities that the mines have to hit. I don't know. It looks like we're doing okay so far. Hmm. This will be interesting because they... A lot of towers struggle with this because there's just so... The sheer volume of enemies that it has to deal with and they come from the back so you get them the whole game but it looks like looks like the encampment's doing pretty good with it I mean this is a little farther than normal but nothing made it past so I'm gonna say it's doing pretty good yeah I mean it, it does 15,000 damage and it has a fire rate of almost 300 rounds per minute you know so of course it's gonna do pretty good but yeah it's a uh, definitely one of the more boring towers to play because it just spits mines out but it's it's pretty strong I give it that it is it is pretty strong all right on to level 35 who are you Robo Oogie might be a little bit I don't know there's a lot of enemies coming in now and that causes a little bit of a problem look at all these just look at the sheer amount of enemies that are here but we've been holding strong so far so I've got faith I have got faith the uh oh yeah. They just they just pile in and wipe out all the landmines, so it's kind of a that's a little bit of a problem. Look at all that. There's so many. We're still doing it though. Hey, he's putting in the work. Where's the Oogie? Oh, he's way back there. I mean, he's doing like pretty good for a solo tower. They don't make it very far. I just want to see how much damage we do to this Oogie. Are we going to one-shot him? I don't know. That is the question. Maybe the two-shot? I think that was about a two-shot. don't think it was exactly a one-shot. But everything else has a similar fate. But yeah, it's pretty good top five, I would say. Top five tower. Well, this is new. I am, uh... <laughs> I'm lagging. From... The numbers. And the amount of enemies. Um... 
Interesting. Okay, it seems to have cleared up now. Now well, Steph's making it kind of far now. Hmm. That was interesting. It did seem like a lot more enemies than usual. That's kind of odd. We are looking at... Uh, let's level these up here real quick. Alright, 106, so almost 28,000 damage on everything. And 399 rounds per minute, level 245. Doing pretty good, besides that weird lag, that was... That's the only thing that's happened recently. Everything else has been going pretty smoothly. We're just cruising along. Let's see if it happens again. It's just a lot of enemies and rockets and... Oh, that was interesting. Look at that. Why does it why does it seem like so much more this time? I've, I I play with the same settings every time. It just seems like there's way more enemies this time. It's definitely lagging. Huh. It's pretty interesting. Is there two different types of missiles? Is that what it... Oh, the sound's gone. Don't zoom in that far. It looks like there's two different types of missiles. Maybe that's why we're getting lag. Because if I'm not wrong, the enemies are randomly generated too. So... Normally I don't get both types of missiles. I don't know. I... Hopefully we can make it to level 45. I think the game is crashing. Can't be 100% sure, but I've got a feeling stuff is making it through. I had to shut the numbers off because it was almost unplayable like that. Hey, we made it. Level 44 probably gonna have to add a photosensitivity warning in there somewhere but uh yeah level 45 I'm gonna turn the numbers on to see if the game will survive there's gonna be lots of flashing so if you guys are sensitive to flashing lights or whatever please click away but I just want to see if the game's gonna crash or not on the next wave but hey we made it this far there's not a whole lot left to do. Just a couple more enemies. It's all these rockets are... I've got both enemies that shoot rockets. And I think that's what's causing this much lag. Because there are so many enemies on the screen at one time. And you can't shut off what they say. You can only shut off the numbers. Which I already did. But, like I said, if you're... Photosensitive, sensitive to flashing lights. Please click away. Because I'm going to put the numbers back on. And this should get interesting. Let's do it. Level 45. There's going to be a lot of flashing lights, I'm sure. I don't know if I like this WASD because I can't control it as much as the mouse. Here comes Oogie. Whatever that says, I can't really read it. I don't want to zoom out anymore, I don't think. Oh, wow. Um. Oh, we forgot to look at the tower. 551. And 50,000 damage. Uh-oh. Game's not doing so hot. We'll just let it figure out what's going on and... Something will happen. Hasn't crashed yet. And we're still making gold. So we haven't lost yet. I don't really know what's going on anymore. Oh! We did lose! Interesting. 
Well, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please leave a like down below, hit that subscribe button, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.